Hello, Internet. Welcome, everyone. We are the Grin Brothers. What he said. Yes, and we're back to playing Project Spark. Or should be back to playing Project Spark. We've yet to actually test whether this is actually worth well, Click on it. Yeah. As you can see, we'll be playing Conker's Big Reunion, hopefully. Let's just test to see if this actually works. Because apparently all their stuff became free. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure that must be what the like 2.3 gigabyte uh, update happened on uh, Xbox One. Yeah. Because um, if people don't know, Project Spark has been basically cancelled. Yes. Uh, Team Geco has been disbanded by Microsoft along with, I think it's Team Geco has been disbanded, along with, of course, Lionhead Studios, which I'm still very bitter about. No, everyone is. The voice actor sounds like Sid from Ice Age. I know it's the A same. I know it's the same voice actor, but <clears throat> wait, really? It's the same voice actor as was originally in Conquered '64. Oh, really? Yeah. Jesus. Not not the same voice actor for Sid, but it's gonna sound like Sid. I'm saying, who would turn around and say, "Sid, you are the perfect voice for a violent, alcoholic-induced squirrel." Um. Hello, Scarecrow. Is it really the same voice actor? Sound... Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure it's the same voice actor. It has been a while. Okay. A little quieter, please. Yeah, you can tell it's been a while. Oh, I, don't feel so good. I love the Project Spark Conquer design. It is, especially compared to... Kid Conquer. Yeah, Conquer. that was, that was um, terrifying. But honestly, the get... Conquer just looks fitting for it. And I love the... Well, I, think I like the style of... Yeah, uh, the style of Project Spark. Project Spark beginning. in general is really nice. Uh, the cock and plucker. I, uh, that is funny how, you know, this, you know, E-friendly game... It's not. ...got uh, started to create... <laughs> ...got given the license to make a conquer game <laughs> using their engine. Yeah, that doesn't really make sense. Yeah. Like, it's the most mismatched thing, but I think it... Kind Let's of not was... give it to Rare. Let's again, instead conquer, give it to these then guys. Again, it's conquer who they've been doing all the experiments with. Yeah. Like... Who are we going to have for our HoloLens game? Who could it to conquer? Not Banjo Kazooie. That'd make too much sense. Oh, context sensitive. Instead of a ting. Yeah. Oh, great. I have to hear for a ding. And you have to. I mean, this serves a chocolate bar for half. Yep. So, like. I mean, I've not really played Conker's Bad. Yeah, further. we've got the whole game here, so that's good. All one chapters. Yep. Of it. Oh yeah, I can't do anything because, of course, you're I'm... hungover. I don't know if it'll be. be able to talk. I don't know if it'll be as funny as the original. The original was very funny, but ding. You don't have to say it. <laughs> we don't have to connect, mate. Oh, how did that get in there? Ah. Oh. Screw up his butt. Ah. Oh. I mean, that seems normal. Yeah, pretty normal after you've been drunk. I mean, I've never been drunk before, but... God knows Shouldn't be able to, like, jump in the water to get a hangover. I mean... Oh, he still gets the, keeps the float souls. Floaties. Can he not swim? No, he never could. Wow. Sad. Uh, how do I get out? I oh, know, um... I think I'm stuck. Did you just... Managed to like fail completely. Yeah, already. Oh, oh no, no, there, we there go. you go. Still drunk. Yeah. I figured water would cure me of a hangover. That's how it works, doesn't it? Oh, uh, pretty much. You, you've you've, well, you know, you've, you've uh, drunk uh, alcohol before, haven't you? A hangover is caused because the cells in your brain are dehydrated. If I'm correct. Nerd. Because it basically takes the water away from your cells. Um, that's why you're supposed to drink water. And he's just going to drink an energy drink. I assume. Oh, I'm level six. Yay. Congratulations. <laughs> you can see how little I've actually played this this game. Yeah, A to jump. I played eee! it more, but my problem was I found it very... One. Oh. They, frying pan. They didn't actually have, and now they never will, um, all the tutorials. Yeah, they didn't explain much. I mean, so I remember I didn't know what I was doing. It was complicated to begin with, but it's like... Well, if it's complicated, you're supposed to explain it better. Yeah, they only had, like, one or two tutorials, and that was it. I mean, the story mode did at least explain the brain system. Yeah. You know, the React brain system was the, well explained for the, the story, story mode. The story mode explained how to play 
We <laughs> must have somehow lost that animation. <laughs> um, oh gosh, that is actually pretty funny. I didn't. Basically, he's uh, saying about old controls and how uh, this doesn't have some of the old controls. Yeah. Um, <laughs> pulling out all the trips already, I see. Oh, so this Black Clover the game. Ah, Black Clover. Nothing could be like Black Clover the game. Oh, gosh, I, I suck terrible at this. Yeah, you really <laughs> are sucking. You can do it, I believe in you. There we go. Yay, um, any gear. But no, like, because yep. I, I want to create more things on this, whether uh, the servers are going to be shut down or not. Hopefully you can still create things, you um, just probably won't be able to share them online. But it's like they never actually made the tutorials to actually explain how to make things. It explained how to play, but not make. And that was oh, wow, I... that's a very short episode. If that's all we um, have to go to to get to uh, Cock and Plucker. Done. Yeah, wow. Um, but this is a Grim Brothers Mini now, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> More importantly, the problem... A problem for me, personally, was there's no easy way to... There was no easy way to grind the in-game currency. You just really. had to pay for it. Like, but we're not, we're not. I don't have the money. Brainwash to do that. I've got to spend my money on other games, namely Blizzard. Um, <laughs> yeah, I was about to say. <laughs> World of Warcraft. Burn you haven't got the money, and yet you just spend it all on Blizzard instead. Um, or you haven't bought any Hearthstone cards, have you? No, I don't. I mean, I've brought them... You've resisted that temptation. I've brought them before, like, a long... The most I've brought were the new adventure modes, but to be fair, if I didn't buy them, I would never be able to buy them shortly. Mm -hmm. Hashtag, go watch my Hearthstone you video. You need pay tab, $300. Oh. Um, but yeah, it's like... a valid Yeah, you point. can definitely tell how long it's been. Yeah. <laughs> this is ironic uh, for yeah. this game to say that. It's ironic for a game that uses you know, microtransactions based around or used to. Yeah. Being the snot out of things. Yeah, I loved being able to take money from things by murdering. Jesus, he's loud. What are teddy bears. They? Are we fighting furries? You remember the teddy bears, don't you? Probably. They were the villains of the previous Conquer game. Oh. You know, in the multiplayer mode, you were either squirrels or teddy bears. Yeah. And the teddy bears were Why the, were the teddy bears evil? in the uh, Storm of the Beach of Normandy episode. Yeah. Why were they evil? Uh, I can't remember the exact plot. They, I've, they're all stuffed teddy bears. They're made by the villain. Okay. And basically, the whole villain plot line is. The guy needed something to balance his coffee table, and Conquer was the perfect height to fix the broken leg on the coffee table. That is the plot of Conquer's Bad Fur Day. Yeah, that sounds about right. I was going to say, Conquer's why didn't trying he just... to get home after getting a hangover. I was going to say, why didn't he just. I don't know which direction I was supposed to be going. I didn't pay attention. Oh, you're in here. Is that a brewery? I know, you're supposed to basically do a bunch of missions in order to get the money to pay off the tab. Well, yeah, that makes sense. So if you an eye on the door. Uh, well, are you ready to commit murder? You've still got yes. time. There's a chocolate. Oh, good. Oh, you had taken damage. Yeah, from the cutscene. Oh, I didn't realise the cutscene did damage to you. He's throwing bottles at you. Yep. Wow, Conquer. Yeah, the attack animation's a bit stiff. Well, compared to the old Conquer, but then again, before it was still just a frying pan as well. No, the, the reason... Wow, I skipped a few levels. I like how it's also saying you've completed challenges as the characters that you're not even playing as. Um, I, I think the reason it feels stiff is because you're... Conker's attacking like the characters um, in Project Spark. In Project Spark, and their attack animations are a lot slower, kind of yeah. thing. Because Conker, when he attacks, he's just kind of slowing down. Yeah, I do think you know, if built from the ground up, this game probably would be you know really good. But I think this was both basically a showcase of how good this could, you know, you could have your creation engine. I mean, yeah. if they look at how marvelous this looks. 
mm. if they, you know, actually taught you how to use it. Mm. I'm really bitter about that. I'll have to, okay, climb up through here. Things... <laughs> what, why was Project, did, did Team Dakota just suffer the same thing as the other studios that got closed, or what? Uh, I think that's likely to be the case. Again, uh, the direction of pre-Peter... Um, sorry, not Peter. Phil Spencer. Yeah. Um, Microsoft was gaming is all going to be a streaming online-based platform. Yeah. Um, you know, no disc or that. So that's where a lot of the sort of game direction went. Yeah. And I'm assuming it's uh, in part due to a change of direction. Why so the because uh, so, some of these studios were basically tailored to doing the direction. The only and many of them weren't succeeding. Yeah. In these change of directions, the only one which has really been a success is Killer Instinct. Yeah. Uh, which Microsoft have done a brilliant job supporting like the fine game community and all that, and even with a change of directors. Oh, why did you do that? Oh, don't worry, it's only one. And it teleported you back here. Wow. Yeah, that's convenient. Yeah. I'm mean, going to so say you could have literally just... Jumped too far. Mm -hmm. Have you forgot how to platform? Has it been that long? No, since... it is somewhat stiff. Since we uh, played a platforming game. <laughs> when was the last platforming game you actually played? Uh, Kirby and the Rainbow Paintbrush? That barely counts as a platformer. I have to jump in that. You don't. Yeah, but I can just make you platforms. Yes, do you? Not really, because I don't like it. <laughs> I'm too busy on, you know, keeping myself alive. Which, considering if I die, you die, is significantly more important. Um, but yeah, I, I think it's because of the, you know, the change of focus. And this game wasn't a big seller. Like, if this had like, achieved like a million sales, I'd probably kept it around. But otherwise... Going to waste. Oh, thank gosh. Thank God for glitches. <laughs> oh no, nothing over there. The camera's fixed itself when it comes did, to these did, areas. Did people like this game? I, I don't think it was that big. Like, I think a problem is the. So it wasn't like as well received as Little Big Planet 2. Kind no, of no, it's nowhere near well received as Little Big Planet series. I think that's the problem. Little Big Planet is simple. Oh. oh. Little Big Planet is very simple, plus it has more. Well, again, I think it's one of the bigger problems with Project Spark is the the story mode. Yeah, Little Big Planet has a single player content. You know, something you can play immediately, and you can just get everything. You get yeah. everything through that. You don't buy it. Yeah, I Whereas think that Project was Spark has, while it's more in depth, it's you know, it's gotten doesn't have a big enough single player drive to it. Yeah, it didn't have anything. It's, it's base game was too weak. Oh. oh. Probably should have predicted that, but... Yeah, maybe we should have, but I didn't expect it. Like, I... I do feel the biggest disappointment is, like, you know, the lack of a tutorial, the lack of, like, the single player. What the... That was weird. Must have gone on the rim, then. Yeah. I don't know if it's, like, supposed to Ooh, be... Oh, like, I can... Oh, I thought I was over it. If I'd have landed on it. How weird. Tried. It'll probably yeah. be easier if you're on the high point anyway. Probably would be. Yeah. The criticism I heard of this game is quite true to it. What? Oh, darn it. I, did, I thought I hadn't pressed the second jump. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Well, at least I don't have to worry too much about this area because it's not like it's killing me. Um. This would probably be nicer if we could hear the music, but we can't. Yeah, the uh, there's a bit of lag with starting up with movement. Yeah, is that just okay? Now I've reached level eleven. Oh, that must be you just achieving everything. You're not leveling up because you've ah. Oh, okay. You're not leveling up because you've actually achieved anything. It's literally just leveling you up on its own. Okay. What just from playtime? No, just I think it is literally unlocking you everything. Because I don't think... Because it will unlock you points as you unlock more stuff. So it's unlocking everything you that you can get. Okay. I think. Okay, end. 
Oh, darn it. <laughs> this is actually really difficult. Can we uh, stop? Because it's 15 minutes so <laughs> Yeah, stop when I get across. But yeah, no, I we'll do... stop now and then get you across. Yeah, and then, yeah. I th- do think, you know, Project Spark was simply closed because of uh, the whole situation with, you know, Microsoft changing the way they're going about their games and all that. I know. I feel and like this it's... game not being a huge success. If it was a big success like Killer Instinct, they'd have considered otherwise, but... I feel it's a bit of kind of like a wasted opportunity, really. Yeah. I think that's how I feel about a lot of things like Spore. Like Spore. You know, which again, if that was a bigger success... Why, it is, it, pro- why is it the things I really like always just get wasted? There's so much potential. Mm. So much, like, love... And then well, think about some of the things which you really liked, which haven't, you know, been wasted. Ratchet and Clank is still ongoing, unlike all those people who are fans of Jack and Daxter and yeah, Sly Ratchet Cooper. Yeah, Ratchet and Clank's still going, although I'd... It's contemporaries of, like, barely it's, had any instalments. It's very good, but story-wise, I'm not going to enjoy it as much as the previous ones. I know that already. Mm. Um, but yeah, we'll uh, continue this conversation next time, okay? Yes. Cheerio, everyone. Bye.